So we're outside of this Broken Top townhome unit um, in the courtyards of Broken Top, um, looking at the exterior. Um, this garage has been converted and this is what the exterior and entryway look like. All right, so we are entering the home, um, keypad lock, uh, smart doorbell with camera. So as you enter, there's a foyer um, and immediately to the left is a bedroom with bunk beds, smart smoke alarm, Looks like a lock-off closet for owner supplies. Little dresser, small TV. And then this neat area in here, um, that is a hot tub, built-in hot tub, and kind of just kind of cool lounge area. Extra lighting, a beverage fridge big TV, fully insulated, nice and warm. This would be a fun place to hang out for sure. Decking and carpet. Just a whole nother extension of the house. And then we've got a laundry room on the right with cleaning supplies, fire extinguisher, cabinetry. These are all locked off. For supplies, here's the electrical panel. And so on this lower level is a full separate lock off unit and they're calling it unit B. And in here we've got closet, a king size bed, and then a whole separate kitchen. It's got everything someone could need. Oven, range. Freezer and refrigerator. Electric convection oven and microwave. And a nice dishwasher. That sings to you and range hood. Let's see. And then this is a whole nother pull out couch, dining area, more kitchen supplies, a nice vanity, lots of supplies, toilet, and then shower with a really nice head and tub. So this is the whole downstairs separate unit. And then we go upstairs to that door there, which also locks off a couple of other things to point out in this unit B, side table, bench. And then the view from here is not bad. So this is just looking out onto a green space common area and road, so wide angle view of unit B. Okay, so leaving the foyer, heading up the stairs, filter intake, all LVP flooring, so super easy to clean, super clean place in general. Okay, so at the top of this landing here is the other lock off, so I guess this would kind of be considered Unit A, this in addition to what is downstairs in the bunk beds. Coming to the top here, we've got smart thermostat. This is a great room area. This turns the fireplace on. This is probably internet stuff locked off. Oh. Big TV here. floor lamps, so again, fully furnished, completely turnkey, skylight, 
coming in here. Dining room area, seats six, and then there's this full bench back here, and this opens up Ugh, for more storage. Solid surface countertops, quartz. I've got all nice name brand appliances. Everything someone would need for a short-term rental. Super cute little fridge. Got a microwave down here. Oh gosh, I always forget how to use these, but I like them. Fully stocked. Okay, so small dual range, gas range. Even has a little espresso maker. It's nice. Big sink. And then here is the deck. <clears throat> Comes with a little grill. Adirondack chairs, umbrella. It is a little bit of an overhang out here. And some lighting as well. Okay, coming into the bedroom that's up here. Oh, that's locked off, just kidding. Um, all right, bathroom. There's the closet in here, shoe storage. Again, everything someone could need for any length of time. Another nice shower and tub combo with the glass door. Toilet. Towels. Hair dryers, Kohler sinks, nice faucet. And then a queen size bed in this room here. Lots of light from these windows. And this one locks off as well, if wanted. This couch does not pull out, and that's the full scope of the upper part of this unit. So one last little interesting idea would be potentially trying to add or make this into a third unit, third lock-off unit, and really optimizing what you have going on here by potentially adding a little kitchenette here or here um, and having three units in this one townhome. It's just another idea.